Hey guys, Tiani here. Welcome to our channel, Pretty Little Nerds. This week is rant week, so I'm just going to list off a whole bunch of things that annoy the heck out of me. Slow walkers in the hallway when I'm trying to get to class. My sister barges into my room and then leaves without closing the door. People will try to talk to me while I'm listening to music. I have my headphones in for a reason. I'm blasting my music so that I don't have to listen to you, so why are you trying to talk to me? I absolutely hate when people touch me. School, and not to mention all the homework that teachers give us. When people say watermelon, when it's clearly watermelon with a log O. Seeing the word explained after a question on a test you're taking. As soon as I see that word, I, com I know that I'm going to completely chapter 5 that question. By the way, what I meant by chapter 5 that question, I mean absolutely, completely do horrible on that question. Judgmental people. Having to get up at 5.30 in the morning every day for school. When people ask me stupid questions when the answers are obvious. That squeaky sound that wet shoes make when they rub against the floor or when styrofoam runs, rubs together. I am cringing just thinking about it. Cliche scary movies where there's always this there's o where it's always the one girl that's in a house and she hears a noise and when she hears the noise she calls down is anybody there like somebody's really going to answer her saying oh yeah I'm down here making a sandwich you want one it's not like I'm planning to kill you or anything and then later in the movie they're getting chased through the woods which always it always happens to be a woods and then she trips over nothing and the killer's walking in slow motion, and she has plenty of time to get up, but no, she just stays down there. Cause she, she just stays down there, apparently hurt, because she tripped over air. And then somehow the killer always manages to catch up with them. How? You're probably going to hate me for this, but I am a grammar Nazi. I hate bad grammar. If you text me something and it goes like this, then you are not qualified to insult me. Use the right form of your... It is not Y-O-U-R, it is Y-O-U apostrophe R-E, the c contraction of U-R. Get it straight. Just the other day, I was listening to You and I by One Direction, and then the one line is like, nothing can come between you and I. Nothing can come between you and I. And then I was just distracted for the rest of the song, because I'm just thinking it, I'm just thinking, it should be, you and me, not you and I. I mean, I know you're trying to rhyme it, but it's, it doesn't matter. It needs to be you and me. And I'm not trying to hate. It just bothers me because I'm a grammar Nazi. I also kind of have OCD. So if there's like a pile of papers when we turn in something and it's all messed up, it bothers me so much. And I feel like I have to fix it. And then I do fix it. And then somebody puts another paper down, and it's not lined up with the others. I, I, I took time out of my life to organize those papers, and you couldn't even put it with, and you couldn't even put it in line with the other papers. Like, seriously. All right, I think that's enough ranting for today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and comment down below what bothers you. Also, if you like our videos, subscribe to become a unicorn today. Okay, bye.